Hey guys, Lidon and Rickland are not Pam, and of course, the house of biceps. I'm here at the house of biceps answering your questions. Today's question comes in from Leon. Leon wants to know if I've retired and become a permanent gym lifter. All right, Leon, this is uh, tough talk time. All right, that's really a, a tough question to answer. Um, I refuse to say that I've retired. First of all, retired from what? I haven't done anything absolutely amazing uh, in the sport of powerlifting strongman or weightlifting. Um, I've done some pretty neat stuff. I've had some great experiences, but retired from what? <clears throat> Man, that just hurt to say. I absolutely have plans on coming back to the field and competing. Uh, I would say in the future, my mindset is different when it comes to uh, the sports that I want to compete in. I have the desire to compete again in the sport of strongman. I want to compete in the sport of powerlifting. I want to compete again in the sport of weightlifting. And I want to fight again in the sport of martial arts. I would like to do all four of those things as a master's in the same year. But I really have no idea if I can do that. I have enough difficulty doing just one of those things at a time uh, and maintaining health. I know that I'm not going to be happy just showing up. I'm not going to be happy just showing up and taking last place in Strongman. I'm not going to be happy just showing up and making a total in powerlifting or weightlifting. Um, and I'm not going to be happy just showing up and losing my first fight in martial arts. I kind of want to actually do something. Something a little more than just being proud I was there. So that's me looking into the future. Not really for sure when that is, but that desire is still inside of me. And I believe that it will happen in the future. Now, Leon, I will say that my thought process, my desires, my heart, my feelings uh, have changed. As I've gotten older, I am starting to realize that I am that lifter that is no longer the competitor. Uh, and I'm not for sure if I ever was a competitor. In every sport that I have ever been involved in, I loved the training and the friends much more than I loved the actual competition. My biggest memories about competing, just like pretty much any other strongman, it's revolved around friends. They became family. The people that I met, even if we didn't speak the same language, those are most of my memories my good memories and bad memories when it comes to every sport I've ever been involved in. But I like the training. I like fighting in a metal building with a concrete floor and no heat, knowing that I was training harder in worse conditions than everybody else. I like training in this room. It's just part of who I am. I like training hard. I like bleeding from my forehead and sniffing ammonia, yelling, screaming planning training just because it doesn't lead up to a competition doesn't mean it's forsaken or doesn't mean that it's not worth anything. See, I look at it as, well, I'm a mechanic and I'm building a race car. Competing is cool, racing is cool, but as I get older I start to realize that I don't really have the same car as everybody else. You know, my health issues do hold me back. I do have family that I put ahead of other things that I didn't used to. I don't have the same race car that I had 15 years ago. It's not the same car in the shop. I'm a much smarter mechanic. I know how to do a lot more things to a car now than I used to. But my car's got some miles on it. Really, I realized that I enjoy trying to make this car race as absolutely best as it possibly can. And I really don't care how it finishes against other race cars. I really do care how much better it is this week than it was last week. 
I really care more about the mechanic and how much smarter the mechanic is than how fast the car goes down the track. I don't know. Maybe that's the coach, but I'm pretty sure that's the athlete too. My racetrack may be a little bit different than yours, but I guarantee you, when I get on the track, I enjoy putting the pedal down to the metal, seeing how fast it'll go. So Leon, am I retired? Am I going to retire? I will never, ever, ever admit to retirement. I'm just a mechanic, fine-tuning the race car. Thanks, Leon.